KUAM Sports Weekend Roundup is brought to you by Gatorade. Greatness starts with G. The ISA wrestling season features 12 weight classes this year. Southern and Ukudu stepped onto the mat for their first match of 2022. The Dolphins defeated the Bulldogs 54-6. Michael Redman repping Southern defeated Ukudu's Francisco Lanada in the 179-pound weight class via pin in the first period. Teammate Aiden Wright was also victorious in his season debut, picking up the win via pin over Delton Jacob in the heavyweight division. Wright got the takedown midway through the first and was able to secure the pin before time expired in the first period. Female wrestler Annalie Meadow earned her first ever win in the 102 pound weight class. Meno, a sophomore from Southern, has a jiu-jitsu background. She decided to give wrestling a shot and is happy to be representing Southern High. Our school has a good reputation for wrestlers, you know, strong wrestlers. And, you know, a lot of people look down on us because, you know, we're Southern High. And, you know, it's good when we show them who we really are on the map. JFK at home against St. John's for their ESA Basketball League matchup. Knights go up 4-0 behind back-to-back -back scores. Hong nowhere to go, kick out pass to Lewis Koo. Long two no good, Stenson with the board going board for the basket and one. Islanders get the dub on their home court. Vinka with the rebound, pass to Lazama who's out running. Bounce pass to Guzman who gets his grub on. Kirsten finished with a game high 23 points. Turning over to some baseball news, congrats to the Padres for winning the Fall Amateur Baseball League title 11-0. Over the Amigos, the Padres were the number one seed heading into the championship game. Sean Munoz was selected as the MVP. Munoz ended the game with a fifth-inning walk-off, two-run shot. Pitcher R.J. Joe picked up the win on the mound going five innings, giving up three hits to go along with three strikeouts. The Guam Badminton Sports Center, located on Bella Road, is a 10,000-square-foot gym that can host badminton, pickleball, tennis, and other indoor activities. We see Guam with 160,000 population, and there's limited opportunity for people to enjoy sports indoor, because especially on Guam, it's very hot outside, it's raining all the time. And then also we see the growing of sport of badminton and pickleball, and also the need for indoor space for tennis. That's why that motivated us to develop an indoor venue where we, people can access badminton, pickleball, and tennis. The gym has six badminton courts. The Guam Badminton Sports Center is home to 70 badminton players. The Guam High Panthers hosting the GW Geckos in their ISA IIIAG boys basketball game. 11-11 tie after the first quarter. The Geckos took the lead in the start of the second. Both teams playing with tempo from the tip-off. Rosario with the steal, takes it the other way for the layup. GW led by 14 before the home team made a little run. GW's Deion Davis working the inbound play. Davis gets the ball back and puts it up in traffic. Jason Tovez hit for 15 points, knocking down three shots from the outside. Check out DJ Osborne put in work. Osborne with the rebound, goes the full length of the court. Dude was hungry, eating for 17 points. Osborne goes straight to the rack for the finish. Shout out to the nephew, Trayden Rosario, who was cooking. Rosario with another layup. This time, he's spotting up and knocking down the deep ball. He finished with the game high 18 points. Geckos pick up the win on the road, 68 to 55. Caden Apiag hits the baseline shot and draws the foul for the three point play the long way. Turning over to middle school girls volleyball news. Congrats to GAA for winning the East of Volleyball title 2-0 over Jose Rios. GAA finished the season with a 14-2 record this year. The team was led by head coach Silencia Saudir and assistant coach Dr. Daniel O. Girls High School softball from the East of League Academy on their home field taking on the Guam High Panthers. Pitcher Brynalyn Hart brings home Abigail Terry from third base. Guam High ahead 1-0. Throw to first in time for the out on Hart. Leilani Westland next at the plate. Rips a two-run double deep to center field. Panthers go ahead 3-0 off the Westland stand-up double. 
Victoria Wright makes her way to home plate, beating out the throw. Hart recorded eight strikeouts on the mound for the visiting Panthers. Academy made their run in the bottom of the fourth inning with the base runner at first. Gianna Sablon hits a shot to left center. Cadence Chaco goes to second. Heads up base running allows them to pick up an extra base. Chaco makes her way to third and decides to take home. Throw at the plate is dropped. Chaco is safe. Sablon goes to third. Cougars score another run off the short pop-up to right field. Gianna Sablon crosses the plate. Geneva Guerrero going all the way to third base with the RBI triple. Cougars score five in the fourth, one in the fifth, and three in the sixth for the come-from-behind win, 9-7. to seven. It's time to get some buckets. Westbrook Conception pulling up like skrr. He's money on the deep ball. Evan Brown from downtown. Buckets. Brown and the Goats were balling. This time Brown showing his mid-range game with the jumper. Stopping and popping for the game winner. JFK's Carl Vinka was getting buckets. Vinka running on the break. Spin move. One, two. Pull up with the soft touch. Vinka this time working his way from the outside. Drives towards the rim. Contact on the play, still able to get the shot to fall. Teammate Kristen Guzman placing his order for a two-piece. Kristen follows up on the Vinca miss for another bucket. G-Dub's Jason Tovez was getting buckets. Left-handed finish off glass is good. Tovez follows it up with a three-piece from the corner. Yes, sir. DJ Osborne was hungry and getting his grub on. DJ was in attack mode getting buckets. Another finish at the rim for a GW score in the win. Don't forget to send us your best shots. DM our KUAM News on Instagram or hit me up at SHO at KUAM.com. KUAM Sports Weekend Roundup is brought to you by Gatorade. Greatness starts with G.